Hey guys, one more time, Billy McGarrett from NDFCrew.com, and here I am back again with the 25 and plus tips on things you could do on Windows Phone 7 devices on topping and holding. Um, if you haven't seen the other videos, um, make sure you guys check my channel to see the tips number one to five, you know, six to ten, and on and on and on. Okay, guys, now let me go tip number eleven. Okay, tip number eleven. Remember guys, you can always, the start button, or here, the home button, start button, however you want to call it, tap and hold and talk to your phone. Find, sorry, didn't catch, excuse me, find pizza shop. Searching for pizza shop. As you guys can see, just talk to your phone. Tap and hold. Remember, guys, when you tap and hold, it's gonna give you three options, which is find, find places, um, call. You can call up a buddy and start or open, open a program. Okay, guys, I just give you a little preview, which is find, find a restaurant around me. Now, let's say, um, call J. Calling J Dice. So, it's calling my friend Jason. And start Xbox Live. Starting Xbox Live Extras. So you guys can see, talk to your phone. Those are the three commands that you can give to your phone, which is start a program, call somebody, and search for nearby places. Many many people ask me this question all over again, and this is one of the sim one of one of the most easiest things to do in Windows Phone 7 devices. But many people just don't know how to uninstall an application from a Windows Phone 7 device. Now, the hardest thing is to find the application and download the application. Now, how to uninstall an application from Windows Phone 7 devices? Now, this is my menu with all my applications is list is listed, right? It's just easy as this. Let me just pick one. Let me pick a slacker radio. Tap, hold. You see here it says uninstall. Uninstall, and that's about it. Easy as that. You know? Find Facebook, tap, hold, uninstall. That's about it. Also, when you tap here, Penitive Star Menu or Rate and Review. Now, if you Tap on rate and review basically will take it to the review part of the application. We could just review this app, write a review, give it a five five stars, or just one star, say something good or bad about the application, doesn't matter what, this is your choice. Now let's move on to the next one. Let's go to back to the zoom. Let me go to my music and I go to songs. Start playing the song. Um, many people when they try to um fast forward, it, let me put it down. Maybe will ask me how to fast forward songs in Windows Phone 7 devices. Um, if you tap here, no, it's not going to do nothing. It's just going to change the song. Okay? There is no way to do it. The only way to fast forward a song is sit this little fast forward arrow. If you tap it, you go to the next song. Now, what you can do, bring it here and hold. You guys can, I don't know if you guys are able to see it, but it's fast forward fast. Same thing for rewind. Tap and hold and rewind a song. Same thing. Tap, hold and fast forward a song. Tap, hold and rewind a song. This is why. Let's go to the next step. Um, right. Once you're on Internet Explorer, right? Remember guys, there is, you guys already know this, how to pin programs to the start menu. Yes, you guys know this already, but there is many ways to do it, and there is little tricks here. Let me go to my own website, let me go to home.
Now, look at this guys. I could just pin this to my star menu by tapping this, pin to star. Now, there is a web page pinned into my star menu, right? Just tap here and go back to the page, right? Now, you guys see this whole picture here? It's the same is the same picture that is on the tile, right? Now, I just see a whole bunch of things here on the tile. Now, you can just make it a little better. Like you can make the tile look way better. And let me show you how to do this. You can zoom in into the area you want the tile to remember. So, let's say this is the logo of the website. Make sure you zoom in to the logo of the website so you can remember the website. Zoom in on the logo, pin to star. Once you pin to star, make the link. Oh, here's a pretty sample. When I first pinned the website, it looked like this. Now that I zoom in to the logo of the website, now I know what is what I have here on my star menu. You see the big difference? So this is basically up to you if you just want to pin it this way or just pin it this way with the logo so you can know what you just pin to your star menu. Okay, guys. Now, stay tuned. Make sure you follow the other next five tips on Windows Phone 7 devices. Guys, thanks for watching. This is Bill Nakara from NDFCrew.com. And make sure you subscribe to the channel. Give it a thumbs up. Any questions or something, please write it down in the comment box below. And I will be more than happy to answer your questions. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.